being a young single dad, it took me two years to save enough money to take my five-year-old daughter to Disney World. Once we entered the Magic Kingdom, I let her run free and smiled as my financial problems disappeared with her. They say you only die when you're forgotten. I lie in my coffin, as I have for the last 1,000 years, waiting for the sweet release of death. I wish I had never cured cancer. The only guilt the woman had was that she was going to leave her son in a world full of monsters like those who were filming her. Jump, her son commented on the grainy livestream of a woman standing on the guardrail of a bridge. I have some bad news. Your family all died in the car crash, the nurse stated matter-of-factly as I awoke in panic at the hospital, desperately wanting to know about my wife and children. You survived with anterograde amnesia, though, which means you can't form new memories or remember that we've started every day with this conversation since the accident 12 years ago. They call me a monster. My family shun me. I'm unemployed and there is no hope left for me. One sleep-deprived shake when it wouldn't stop crying and my life is worthless now. After my tank run out of oxygen, I swam as fast as I could, desperate to reach the surface. But as my hands crashed against the sand, I immediately understood that in the darkness of the sea, I didn't realize which direction was up. Open the door, I yelled, barely able to catch my breath. The scarf tugged harder as the elevator moved, and I felt my head press against the cold floor. After a horrible car accident, my previously comatose daughter worked hard to write the answers to the doctor's questions, squinting through her bandages. I was so proud, at least until the doctor asked her name and she wrote the name of her best friend who had been buried a week prior. My best friend keeps trying to convince me to stop talking to the man I connected with through a prison pen pal website, but she'd never understand. As I heard him sneak into my house, I never felt so safe as I did in that moment, knowing he'd make sure my father never put his hands on me again. The creepy guy across from me on the train hasn't stopped staring, so I pull out my phone to secretly take a photo just in case. My guts sink in panic when my phone's torch flashes into his eyes, until I realize his pupils never contracted in the sudden bright light. The woman next to me in bed is an imposter, not my wife. I'm stuck, because to prove that to anyone I'd have to tell them where I buried her body. When I came across the magical cup, I wished to swap lives with the rich, cute girl in my class, thinking I would have everything I wanted. But as I sat in her mansion, her mother handed me a glass of water for dinner, amidst a table filled with food, with a stern reminder, girls can't be fat. Live one year without your greatest talent and you get one billion dollars was a deal I could not pass on, so I accepted it. I can't breathe. It's 10 or 11 hours since takeoff, and that flight attendant is pushing the beverage cart down the aisle yet again, smile a little tighter, mascara a little runnier, soda's almost gone now. But this time she's handing out napkins and pens as the captain's voice crackles through the PA system. There's a regional airport outside Sioux Falls, at least there used to be. I could land this bird safely and we could all face what's down there together, but I can't blame anybody who votes for the easy way out instead. My husband passed the test when I went away for the weekend and he did a good job taking care of the kids. Now I can finally take that bottle of sleeping pills and not feel guilty. I plan to tell my husband I was pregnant tomorrow, but when my son from my first marriage went missing, my husband smiled as he stroked my belly and said, Now we can make room for our real family. I'll do it later. I'm still young, he thought. Thirty-five years later, still working his regular shift at the grocery store, 
he starts to realize that living in his head was not the same as actually living. 